revolutionary and seasonal greetings to you all. As the year 2019 draws to an end, we want to take this opportunity to thank the people of South Africa for all your support, particularly in the national general elections in which the EFF saw massive growth this year. Remember, this movement of our people, the last hope of the poor masses of our people in South Africa and in Africa in general, was supposed to die and be buried in the dustbin of history in 2019. But we emerged victorious precisely because of your support and eternal encouragement. We therefore thank you because 2019, indeed, it remains undisputed that it was the year of the EFF. As a country, 2019 also showed us that we are a country in war with itself, particularly against the women, the girl child, and all the vulnerables. We must make sure that indeed, in 2020, we find solution against women abuse and child abuse, because this solution must come from men. It is a problem that is created by men, and it is a problem that can be resolved by men. Men should find a practical, long-lasting solution against women and child abuse in 2020. Let 2020 be the year of the woman and the girl child. Let it be the year we reduce rape, femicide, and all violence against women. Let 2020 also be the year of the unity of the oppressed. In solidarity, we should stand against privatization, against unemployment, against landlessness. We must ensure that we fight against the capture of our state by white monopoly. South Africa's only hope lies in the unity of the left and the oppressed masses of our people. Fellow South Africans, the festive season should be a warm season full of joy, fellowship and the reunion of family and friends. At the same time, the festive season is a period in which we lose a lot of our loved ones, particularly because of reckless driving and people drinking and driving. We call upon all of you who are traveling to be safe, do not speed, do not drink and drive. Because when you drink and drive, you are already intending to kill someone on the road. We call upon the police and the traffic officers to deal with those who drink and drive and who go over the speed limit decisively because they are playing with the lives of our loved ones. We once more want to say, do not drink and drive. Do not drive over the speed limit. Do not use the cell phone while you are driving. Be a responsible citizen. If you love yourself, you will also love fellow travelers on the road. To all adults out there, please do not neglect the young ones. Look after them because you know they are perpetrators out there. The youth of South Africa, I call upon you to stay away from drugs and if you drink, please drink responsibly. Those who are ready to engage in sexual activities, do so in a safe manner. Those who are not ready, abstain until you are ready. We don't want you to die out of being irresponsible. We want you to live law, to realize economic freedom in our lifetime. We want to pay a special attention and salutation to all the workers who will be working during the festive season, particularly those who are in the essential services, the health workers, the police, the traffic officers, security guards, we thank you for looking after our people. We are saying, please continue to provide service because if you do not do so, no one else will provide that type of service. You are highly, highly appreciated because we know that you have refused to get involved in the festivities so that you can look after South Africa. Fellow South Africans, please be responsible. Know very well that we must still pay for the fees of our children next year. We don't want to blame it on our friends when they can't help us next year 
out of acting in an irresponsible manner. As you continue to dance to different types and genres of music, be responsible. Don't just go around saying to people, Well, you know very well that next year is going to be a crisis for you and your family. And you'll be irritating us with social media statuses that says when days are dark, friends are few. When it is you out of dancing to music and festivities, you acted in a manner that is unacceptable. So please remember that January is still coming. You have to pay the rent. You have to pay the fees. You must still have money for transport to go to work. So as you are going all out to enjoy yourself, have that at the back of your mind. Our people are still struggling from Cape to Cairo. The people of Palestine are still struggling. The people of Western Sahara, Venezuela, all of them, as we celebrate, we should also remember them and say to them, tomorrow will be better than today. We are with you, the oppressed masses of the world, particularly you, the people of Cuba. We are with you against the imperialist forces who have imposed economic embargo on you to try and undermine the socialist revolution in Cuba. You are a beautiful nation and you must never doubt yourself that the people of the world are with you. You were with us in the trenches when it was not fashionable to do so. You helped to liberate the continent of Africa and it is now our turn as the people of the world to support the Cuban nation. Hasta la victoria siempre. Victory is certain. We shall overcome. I thank you.